Police say a Cedar Springs man stomped a cat to death in front of children. Now 35-year-old Michael Stackhouse is facing up to eight years in prison. New tonight, neighbors who saw it are calling his actions disturbing, to say the least. 24 News 8's Tom Hillen spoke with Stackhouse tonight. Now, Tom, why does he say he did this? Well, Stackhouse says that the reason he did this is because the cat jumped into his mobile home and started to attack his dogs. And as his attempts to get the cat out of his home, he hurt it and then killed it, he says, to put it out of its misery. It was very disturbing. Larry McDaniel was sitting outside of his home on Wednesday when he saw something shocking. Well, I just seen cat come outside. And the cat was head was beat up. He come out and he stomped the cat. The he in this case is Michael Stackhouse, who we tracked down. Mr. Stackhouse, can I talk to you real quick? Uh -huh. Can I talk to you real quick? About the cat. Yeah, this is about the cat. According to Stackhouse and his wife, a cat jumped over their dog pen door and got into their home. Stackhouse said he tried to get the cat out, but it got past him and ran into their bedroom where their two dogs were and started to attack his dogs, one of which is five pounds, the other about 12 years old, he says. Both, they say, were injured in the cat attack. And they were all after. scrapping. He grabbed the cat, yanked it out from underneath the bed, and it smacked the door, door jam, and that cat, its fate was sealed before it left my house. Stackhouse says he then threw the cat in the road, but it was twitching, and that is when he stomped on its head and killed it. Do you regret stomping on its head, though, in the street? Yeah, I, yeah, I do regret that because it was in front of God and everybody. I, that, um, that was my bad, and that's the only thing that I feel that I did wrong because there was kids. His wife says it did not have to play out like this. In my mind, this is the cat owner's fault for not taking proper precautions to control her pet. I control mine. I expect everyone else to do the same. Stackhouse says this has been blown way out of proportion and he doesn't think he should be charged at all. The felony charge of animal cruelty causing death carries up to four years in prison, but because Stackhouse already has a felony on his record, that time could double to eight years. He is scheduled to be in court later this month, Marley. Just an awful situation all around and then to think that children were there to see the whole thing. Oh, absolutely. And that was the part he said he is remorseful about, about mm. the children seeing this. And we don't know how many kids were there or how many, car or how right. many kids witnessed this, but still, I mean, one is too many. Well, we'll follow it and see what happens in absolutely. court. Absolutely. All right, thanks, Tom.